everyone has to find their own individual path and understand how that affects the greater good. Here at the Springs, we're just here to foster that. We're at the Springs, and I'm with co-founder Jared Stein. How's it going? So glad to be here. So why come to LA and open this beautiful wellness center, yoga studio, juice bar? Yeah, I was in New York for like 13 years, uh, and Kimberly, uh, my partner and co-founder, we were into you know yoga, we both became vegan, we were into juicing sure. and detox and wellness and all this stuff, and we realized like there isn't one place where you can have all of that. There really is not. So we thought, well, if we want to build this, this is the place to do it. Okay, so walk us through the different areas that we can experience the spring. Sure, so uh, the, the first element we like to think of is up front. Over there is our juice bar. So we make all our own cold pressed juices in house. You can grab a smoothie to go. Then we have, um, you know, our restaurant, the cafe, if you will. And then wellness center. And then, yeah, so way. up there is our wellness center. Uh, and then lastly is our yoga studio. Wellness Center here at the Springs with yoga and wellness director Gloria Baracchio. <laughs> thank you so much for joining us. Hi, sister. Thank you. You lived in Hawaii for a long time. Born and raised in Hawaii. What would you say about your practice in LA as opposed to Hawaii? I feel like in the City of Angels or in this metropolitan city, you have to be on your A-game for your yoga and your wellness because if you don't know yourself and if you're not grounded and centered, you will get eaten. So how is yoga tied into the eating, the sleeping, the, the holistic picture? Yoga means union. Yoga means that all things are one, all things are interconnected, whether they're the trees, the plants, the animals, definitely other human beings probably connected to us or related to us. So how are yoga poses tied to nature? There's such a huge mirror between the two. Mm. The first thing is breath, right? Yoga is breath, yoga is union with uh, divine energy. And so in nature, it's finding your center and knowing how to balance and then sway. So you can have a tiger pose and you can have um, the cheetah pose or the <laughs> lion pose because some of these sages were actually friends with these types of animals. Is it my mom always tell me that the, the light ring. Okay, ready? It's a deep inhale. I like doing that just because it actually reminds me of like Maori culture as well.